positive. You know, I'm sure Robert is trying like never before. It's the biggest opportunity in his life. Unifying against a, a non-defeated world champion, pound for pound, one of the best. So he's, he's, he's focused and, 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 and ready. But little things like that, you know, the trainer has to come in and, and try to make his body feel better. Robert, if all goes well Saturday night with Mikey Garcia and you can't get Errol Spence by the end of the year, will the winner of Sean Porter or Danny Garcia treat you and Mikey Garcia? No, they're fighting September, early September, I believe. So definitely, man, you know, uh, you know, we still don't have a winner there, so we can't we can't say who who uh, who's gonna win, and we don't you know we can't really we don't know how tough a fight's gonna be. So either one of them could fight before the end of the year. But uh, but I, if you ask me, I prefer the winner of those two, you know, than 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 uh, Errol, than Errol Spence. But you know, at the end of the day, Mikey makes his decisions, and uh, whatever decision he makes, I'm gonna support him. And, and I know he's got the skills, he's got the, the heart to compete against anybody. Talking about that fight, who's gonna win that fight between Danny Garcia and Sean Porter? It's a tough fight. It's, it's tough. You know, skills-wise, I would pick Danny Garcia, but Sean Porter is very tough. Man. He's always proving me wrong. I, 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 a few fights I've, I've, uh, I've not bet, but chose against him, and he comes out and wins. He's just a very tough guy that, that does anything to win, so I wouldn't be surprised if he wins. But hey, it's a tough fight. It's not, it's not an easy call. Robert, you told Brian Custer that he didn't mention the roster. Who's well, look, roster? maybe because maybe cause we're Mexicans, you know. He, he mentioned everybody. Well, you got that, all the Mexican fighters. He mentioned all the, all the, all the, all the you know, I don't want to, you know, all the black guys that, that uh, Cunningham trains, well, you know, he didn't, he didn't mention none of my Mexican <laughs> fighters. I have a lot of them, too. I have a lot of them. He didn't mention them. That's that, you know, I was, I just kind of, uh, I wanted to know why he didn't. <laughs> right? Who do you have? Tell people Robert. somebody you fight <laughs> You know, everybody. We, all, we watch all your channels. We watch all your videos. <laughs> okay, yeah. Obviously, I'll just talk with Earl Spence. I'm, you guys are both with PBC and now Heyman. So does that mean that Earl Spence is actually interested in this fight? I mean, we're, I, Mike I is talking about it. I haven't talked to Earl Spence. I want to go, I, I want to see him. I know he's probably around here. I want to go see him and I want to be his friend. Because I want to <laughs> take it easy. I wanna, you know. Go fight somebody else. <laughs> fight the winner of Johnny Garcia and uh, yeah, yeah, some part of it. You know, you know what I mean. Uh, now, nah, Errol Spence. Uh, I've never really met him, but uh, it seems like he's a great person. And uh, if you know, if the fight happens, it won't be because we hate him or because we want to. You know, we just don't like him. It's going to be because Mikey just wants the challenge and Mikey wants to test himself. And uh, and uh, you know, my job, my father's to train Mikey and help get him in the best shape of his life. And you know. Well, I'll go with the upset, you know, because it would be an upset. And Mikey, Mikey, like Mikey said in the, in, the, in the press conference, you know, every time Mikey fights, he, you know, he's supposed to win already. So he wants a challenge where he's not supposed to win, and he goes out and pulls it out. That's what that's what he wants. And I don't, I don't know. Maybe I wanted to fight the only fight that there'll probably be 50 50 or maybe some, maybe a little bit more leaning towards. Uh, Lomachenko, if that was to happen, but I don't see that happening anytime soon. You know, Bob Arum and, 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 and ESPN. I, I, I think I think that fight that fight is only going to happen when it's that big, where they're forced to make it. I don't think it's going to happen soon. So that's why Mike is probably leaning towards. Errol Spence. That, that's my Master. next question is, I guess, I mean, if it's not Errol Spence, sorry, sorry. and like you said, Lomachenko does seem a few years away, who is it? Who, like, or is it just kind of well, I think it is going to be Spence. I think it is going to be Spence, man. I, you know, I, the way it looks, that's, 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 what, that's the fight that's, that one Mikey wants, and I'm pretty sure that's the fight that's probably going to happen. I've never seen you... Like, I, you don't seem juiced about that matchup at all. Like, you look, like, I've never seen when, kind of like. Because well, cause cause I'm, look, maybe <laughs> after Saturday night. <laughs> I'll be a little more juice. Right now I'm focused. I'm 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 focused and I don't want to look past uh, Robert Easter. Robert Easter deserves that respect. He's a world champion, he's undefeated, and he's gonna I'm sure he's in the best shape of his life, so he's gonna he's gonna do everything that it takes that he that he can do to beat Mikey. So if that happens then there's no no what what, what would we have been talking about Aero Spence? We gotta beat uh, Robert Easter first. After that, then I'll be more than happy to to tell you that we're ready. We're gonna start training right away. We're gonna have to get some muscle there for Mikey. <laughs>